Hi, my name is Vinod and this video is for explaining the financial statement analysis and this is the first part. Financial statement analysis is one of important tool of management accounting and uh, in financial statement analysis uh, we have to make a comparative uh, balance sheet and comparative income statement so today we will make a comparative balance sheet and then we will uh, do comment on it first uh, liability side liability side this is uh, 2010 and this is 2011 and uh, changes and percentage. Suppose our total capital in 2010 is uh, 1 lakh. But in 2011, our capital will increase by 80,000, 1 lakh 80,000. Increase is 80,000. This is the 80% increase. This is 80% increase. And we see our asset side. Asset side. And uh, our fixed asset in 2010 and uh, 2011 and changes changes percentage in 2010 this is a uh, one lakh and it increased one lakh forty thousand. 1,40,000 our fixed assets in 2010 is 1,00,000 and in 2011 is 1,40,000 this is increase of by 40,000 if 40,000 divided by 1,00,000 we will get and multiply with 100 we will get 40% increase so this is a 80% increase and this is 40% increase now we can give a comment that uh, our total long term capital total capital share capital and equity capital is not utilized in purchasing of fixed assets 40% less amount is utilized so this is a question of uh, uh, investors and management we may invest this share capital in current asset also or it may be happen that uh, we invested in the payment of liabilities so Liabilities means uh, we uh, utilize this 40% in paying off our debt. So these are the questions which uh, management should discuss. And next is uh, our other liabilities. Liabilities means long term debt. And this is uh, 1 lakh in 2010 and uh, in 2011 this is 1 lakh 50,000 and increase is uh, 50,000 50% increase and current asset is 1 lakh here it increased by uh, 2 lakh this is increase of 1 lakh it means 100% increase from this we can get idea 
some money of this we invested in fixed asset and uh, will this long term debt is utilized for buying current assets so this amount indicates that uh, we face loss by this in increase in uh, share capital and then current liabilities suppose current liability is 1 lakh and this is uh, 4 lakh this is 3 lakh this is 300% increase this shows us that uh, our current liabilities like uh, bank order ups uh, sundry creditors bill payable outstanding expenses uh, this increase by 300% but uh, increase 100% so our working capital is also negative so this uh, is a 200% negative working capital so this is a not a good financial position which we can calculate only making the comparative balance sheet and uh, in uh, other side we can write profit and loss account debit balance this is 1 lakh and uh, this is 1 lakh 50000 Fifty thousand increase, fifty percent. It means we are gaining fifty percent increase of loss. Our loss in the balance sheet is one lakh. Now it will become one lakh fifty thousand. Our increase of loss is fifty thousand. So company will take decision to decrease this loss so that company is structured. its business uh, or merge with the other company okay so all these uh, decisions uh, only to only will be taken by watching uh, these percentages thank you very much for watching this video